another wonderful um, session uh, uh, at the APCCC meeting on treatment of biochemical recurrence and PSA persistence. I think what we saw there were talks on, um, you know, what if there is a recurrence after primary treatment uh, in the pelvis, like pelvic lymph nodes? Um, should we be treating with radiation? I think in general, there, there's the consensus of yes and, and treating kind of the, the, the pelvic nodal fields um, in particular, meaning uh, more data to support treating nodal chains and fields rather than just stereotactic treatment of the one or two lymph nodes that light up on PET over, or other imaging, for example. So discussions of radiation field design and how to combine that with systemic therapy. And then there was also uh, a lot of uh, great talk about systemic therapy management in patients with biochemical recurrence after radiation or, or prostatectomy. Um, uh, and, and, and in particular, the high-risk biochemically recurrent uh, patients and the use of uh, AR antagonist therapies, RPs, um, uh, uh, the, the recent uh, reporting of the Embark trial and the use of enzalutamide, enzalutamide with Lupron or, or even enzalutamide monotherapy. And, and uh, so a lot, of, a lot of discussion on how to manage that systemic therapy. And then what if patients sustain a second biochemical recurrence um, uh, and, and how to manage those patients? So really a lot of wonderful topics covered at uh, the APCCC, just going through kind of stepwise management of prostate cancer uh, through its natural, um, natural history.